Hello everyone, my name is Carrie. Happy mini savings challenge day. So I'm really excited to stuff our mini savings challenges. I got my ones here and my dice. So let's get into it. These are always my absolute favorite videos. I love doing mini savings challenges. So this is my mini savings challenge binder and we're just gonna take all of our um, challenges out here and then we're going to shuffle all of these up so that hopefully everything will get a really fair amount of money which uh, my dice likes to avoid specific challenges and dump everything into like the number six spot or something <laughs> I don't know if you have dice that does that um, or mine likes to just focus on like four and five or something. So it's really funny. Okay, so we have all of our mini savings challenges here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put, um, I'm gonna roll the dice and I'm gonna put my ones, which are $50 in ones that I have. And I'm gonna put two bills into each one, whatever the dice tells me to roll. So this is number one, two, three, four, five, six. And then once we get to the spot where we're gonna count everything, I will go over who made the challenges and then how much they are for each one and that kind of thing. So let's get into it. Before I get started, I'm just going to move these up a little bit so they're easier to see. And then let's hope for some really good dice rolls today. So this is the final um, mini savings challenge video or, or yeah, video, I guess. Um, this is the final time for the month of August that I'll be doing this. It's not my final time like forever. It's just for the month, which has just been going by so, so quickly. And I'm just really, really... I'm loving the year so far. It's been a lot cooler lately. We've gotten a lot of rain, which our state really, really needs. Um, there's like, I grew up in a really um, wet place and like I got a ton of rain and it's just always green there. And then now, you know, as I got older and got married and moved away and stuff, um, the place I live in now is extremely dry. I feel like my hands are always dry. Everything is, my hair is really dry and all that stuff so I'm used to growing up in a very sort of humid place and this is not at all all right what is this three okay but uh, yeah so the weather has been really really nice and I love this time of year it's my favorite I do not like summer I want summer to be over goodbye summer don't come back <laughs> um, okay cool so everything got a little something um, but yeah, so the time has been going very quickly, but I'm not upset at all because I enjoy it moving. And uh, once we finish this week's savings challenges and see what we are, are have completed, then we'll be able to add them to our, um, we only have a few left. We'll be able to add them all together to the ones that we did throughout the month and uh, see how much we finished in total. Um, so like how many savings challenges we finished in total and then I have a sort of a, a revamp of what we're going to do with the savings challenge money. Okay, so let's clean all this up and this challenge only got two dollars which I'm not super upset about because I think it's a lower challenge anyway like a lower amount so it's okay if it um, stays around a while. <laughs> okay, so to get started we have this really pretty plant and succulent savings challenge from Paula underscore budgets. Each plant I made $2 and um, it had $4 last week. And everybody will be linked down below in my description. This was a freebie on her channel I believe so you can go and check that out. It came in a set of three. So this week it got one, two, three, four, five, six dollars. So let's I'm gonna just grab a pen and then mark off two, four, six for this week. So we should have 10 in total now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars in our really cute challenge here. And then I think last week we finished two challenges. So I'm interested to see if we finish any this week. It'll be our final chance to complete anything for the month. All right, so let's see. This challenge is really cute. It is a fruit tart from the Catastrophic Budget, and it's with a K because her name is Cat. 
So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dollars this week. We're nearly there, but I don't think we're going to finish it. So we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we just need four dollars. Hopefully next week we'll be able to wrap this one up because I'm really excited to bring in some of my fall mini savings challenges that I have to sort of wrap up the summer that we have already or the summer challenges we've used already. All right, so this is a total of $30 um, and we have four left, so we should have 26. So 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Cool, so we are on track with this one. Hopefully next week we'll get some good money going into that one. Ooh, this one got a good amount of money this week. Usually this one gets stiffed too for my really, really fair dice. So this is a um, $36 challenge. It actually is little cheesecakes from Cheesecake Budgets. And I made each icon $2. So this week it got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 dollars. Um, I don't think we needed that much. So we definitely finished this one. I'm trying to find... Mm. All right, well, my other red pen ran away from me somewhere. So I will just color these in. So that's two, four, six, eight, and $10 in total for this one. So, so cute. It kind of makes me want to have some cheesecake, you know what I mean? All right, so this should be a total of $36, and I think we have $2 left over, so let's just set those aside. So we have 10, 20, 5, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So $36 for our first completed challenge for the week. This is for the final week of August. So yay, one down total of $36 there. So now we need to bring in a new one to replace this. Since we're bridging the gap between fall and summer, I thought it would be really cute to bring in this little avocado challenge. This is from Sassy Peanut Budgets and it's a roll and save or you can just like make each, you know, bubble or circle whatever you want. So I think we should do $2 for each one. Um, since we have two dollars to start this week and we're just gonna say two dollars and then each one will be two dollars after that so um, I'll add up the total and then write that here but we're gonna get started with two dollars this week so cute I love avocados and just how cute they are and I have a couple other ones in my collection that I'll be hopefully be able to bring out later this year next up is this really cute <laughs> Angry Duck and Lovey Duck Challenge. This is from Weekly Budgets Co. I made each box $4 for a total of $36 for this challenge. And last week we saved, um, uh, well, it was a total of $10. So we did four, eight, and then 10 for half. And so then this week we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars $10 again. Wow. All right, so we're gonna be able to color in two more full blocks and then finish coloring in this one. So this is, that was uh, two and this is, um, so this is eight and then two more is 10. So we should have $20 in this challenge now, I believe. So we have five, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Awesome, cool, so this one is moving right along. I just added it into the collection last week, but it is already making great, great progress. All right, and these last two are from Bookish Mama Budgets. This one is her like summer fruits that she has. This is the grapefruit challenge. Um, this one came in a set of three and I've already completed the lemon savings challenge that was with this. You guys voted and helped me out and each one of these little grapefruits is worth $4 and each block, empty block is worth two. So this week, it got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That might have been our winner for the week. So we're gonna mark off this final. So that's four, six, eight, 
10 and 12, making really great progress on this one now. It got a really slow start there for a few weeks, but now we're rocking and rolling. So the total we'll save for this challenge is 44, and so far we have 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3. Nope, that's not right. So this is 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, yeah, I was going to say, if it's a, if these are all, you know, even numbers, it can't be an odd number in the bag, <laughs> or in the envelope. All right, finally, our little mini challenge, mini, mini challenge that we have with our super cute lemons and pigs. It saves a total of $20. It's from Bookish Mama Budgets. It got $2, so we're going to be able to cross off one and two, which, like I said, not a bad thing. It's a smaller challenge, and it could potentially, you know, um, get completed really quickly. So far, we've saved five, six, seven, eight dollars towards our 20. So it looks like we only finished the one this week. Um, let's see, this one from Cheesecake Budgets. So let me grab all of the ones that we finished throughout the month and we will add them up to get the full total. I was able to find all of our completed savings challenges. So let's see how many we have gotten so far completed, well not so far, for the entire month of August. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. So I think we finished since six last week as well. I mean last month, what am I saying guys? Um, all right, so six completed challenges, but we had a few bigger ones in here. So I'm really excited to see the total for the month of August that we've saved. So this one is 56. And this one is 24. Um, this one is also 24. Our 36 challenge that we just completed. This one is 12 and 32. So a total of $184 saved. I think last month we saved like 230 something. Um, so it's still pretty good. And then what we're going to do is we're going to add this to uh, all of the scratch off savings challenges that I finish in at the um, fourth cash stuffing of the month for the, my fourth weekly budget. And then we'll add all this up together and then we will be able to put this towards um, our home projects. So we're sort of wrapping up a lot of our home projects because we moved in about three months ago. So what we're doing is pr I'm going to put this extra money probably towards paying off our carpet. So we bought all new carpet for our house and uh, we worked with a local company and they gave us 0% financing for a year. So we went ahead and it was around $8,000. We put that on there. We paid about half and then we put half on the finance since it was 0% and we didn't have to pay any fees or anything. So we'll put this towards that probably. And then every month, all of our extra mini savings challenges will go towards our uh, carpet payoff. So six completed challenges for this month. It was a really good month, $184 total saved. So thanks for hanging out with me today and uh, being with me throughout this entire month as we save some extra money. I look forward to seeing you in my next cash stuffing and looking forward to starting new challenges in September. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.